now, I'm Kenya. Yo, I'm Kendra. We're, We're twins. twins. We, we love to watch. watch. And this, this is our reaction to Marvel Studios' What If Captain, Captain Carter were the, the first Avenger. Hey, you. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm really excited about this. Hey, I me think, too. Uh, you know, we know Marvel TV has been killing the game. It's been, it's been killing, killing it. the game. I think this one's gonna be a fun one. Game, game. <laughs> because it's putting all of our uh, familiar favorites into new and interesting scenarios. It's animated, and the animation looks gorgeous so far. So yeah, I'm really excited to see this one. This one's, I, I, I think it's gonna hit all the marks and check all the boxes for me. Like, I'm, I'm so excited. Is, are we gonna see stuff here that might get mentioned in, in, in Maybe so. I don't know. I'm not gonna say for certain. I think maybe when we do a little bit more research, we can come back and, and, and say for sure whether or not this series will be canon uh, in the movie verse. Um, but we do know that Marvel uh, intends to make more animated series for Disney Plus. Um, on top of what they, you know, have already got planned for season two of Loki and whatnot. And I'm just really, really excited for the future of Marvel. Okay, guys, if you like what you see, please like our video. If you haven't subscribed already, why not subscribe? And make sure you have your notifications turned on so you never miss a video from us. We will, we will be reacting to so much more Marvel and so much more DC and more animated shows and more horror. Um, so, yeah, it's going to be a great time on the channel. We are almost at 4,000 subscribers. So, please, please be one of those subscribers. It's going to be a good yeah, time. Yeah, if you watch our videos and you haven't subscribed yet, just hit the subscribe button, man. It doesn't cost you anything. All right, guys, without further ado, let us react to Marvel Studios What If, episode one. Oh, it's just beautiful. Time. Jeffrey Wright. Space. Oh my god, this is so awesome. Wow, that's so good. Already, I'm just looking. Stanley Tucci. It's more than a linear path. Bradley Whitford. Of course, Ron Swakorn. The voice. Daryl Hammond. We're a single choice. I love the glass break. Into infinite realities. Creating alternate worlds from the ones you know. I am the Watcher. Hey, Watcher. I am your guide through these vast new realities. Yeah. Follow me and ponder the question. What if? What if? Oh man, I'm hooked already. I'm ready. Let's ponder the question, sir. I'm ready. First lesson. Present. Earth, June 1943. The Nazi army marches across Europe, leaving death and destruction. Red Skull. The Allied this army is kind of reminds me of to Avatar. create a new kind of soldier, a super soldier. At humanity's darkest hour, a skinny kid from Brooklyn became Captain America. After turning the tide of World War II, he made the ultimate sacrifice, restoring peace and saving this universe. But in another universe, a single choice created a whole new hero. Agent Carter, wouldn't you be more comfortable in the booth? No, I prefer to stay. There. That's the moment that created a new universe. When asked to leave the room, Margaret Peggy Carter chose to stay. But soon it would be her venturing into the unknown and creating a new world. The subject will be saturated with Peggy's gonna hurt. Eyes on me. 
Focus on me. Oh no. Oh. Power Steve, the drop. No. We either do this Steve. now or we lose the project. Rogers, get in there. He caught. Stark, you go in. What? Are you crazy? I push the buttons. I'm the buttons guy. Stark, get over there. Tech and bullets don't mix. We're gonna lose everything. It has to be now. Do you know how much this costs? We won't get another shot at this. Hang on. I'll be right back. I'm not going anywhere. Howard, get ready. Agent Carter. What are you doing? <laughs> Howard was like, yeah, that's the ticket. That's Agent just the Carter, name we need. This is our only chance. Now! Stark, don't do this. Do it, Stark. Hills anymore. <laughs> hey, <laughs> <that's fire. laughs> I'd call this an absolute success. Oh, she looked good. She looks absolute amazing. failure. Sixty million dollars and all the hope in the world down the drain. Oh, because I was it's a woman. An army. I was promised peace and salvation. Instead, I get a girl. I understand this is not the desired outcome, but I can be more than a human pincushion. The SSR is under my command now. Be grateful you're in the room and not being brought up on charges of insubordination. We were about to lose the entire project. If I hadn't stepped well, in... Well, we did. And if we get lucky, someday your blood might tell us how to make a real super soldier. Oh, I pound his face and him. Women aren't soldiers. And they sure as hell don't fight on the front lines. They might break a nail. <laughs> nice left hook. Not according to Colonel Flynn, the weapons great moron! Hey. Ooh. If only I was allowed God to do that damn and hit his girl. Head. Oh, it could be worse. Flynn could stick you on one of those USO tours. Bucky. It's a buddy of mine from Brooklyn. He just deployed with the 107th. The army won't even tell me where he's going. We all have someone fighting for us. It would be nice if we could fight for them. You were meant to be the one to end the war. Now you will. And don't worry about me. I never was much of a dancer anyway. Oh, <laughs> Steve. Maybe you haven't found the right partner. Tesseract was the jewel of Odin's treasure room. Fable to hold the power to rewrite the very laws of physics and unlock That's more across the universe. What you seek is just a legend. And why do He's you try so hard before. to hide it? I kind of made him look more like Ross. Hydra High Command, it's game over. I'm not risking one man, never mind a platoon, over man. a glorified battery. The greatest minds yeah. alive. Idiot. And Stark is one of them. This doesn't concern you. You're lucky to be in the room. Colonel, the greatest minds alive can't fathom the extent of this battery's power. Good. Who knows? Maybe the war will be over before Hydra figures out how to turn the damn thing on. Wow, what a dumbass. Girl, you should go anyway. I thought you Brits were supposed to be resilient. Not just the men, apparently. Can I give you a piece of advice? I'd rather you didn't. Flynn's a moron. Lucky for you, I'm a genius. <laughs> Your covert skills need work. Then this is gonna be awkward. Oh! Oh, he gave her the... British flag. British show. Oh! oh. Hey! Spider, this is the father! Whoa! Yeah! Oh, hey, Captain Carter! Oh! Yes. Union Jack. Union Jack. Nice to the party! Yeah. Oh, oh, that was brilliant! Yes, it was. Go, 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 girl. Oh. Hey! Exactly. 
quickly. The war's out there, Colonel, not in here. If we're going to win, it won't be with me stuck behind a desk. Is this nuclear? Are you listening? You're an agent. You're not qualified for field duty. Then you better promote me. Captain has a nice ring to it. I trust you know what to do with that. Oh, I know exactly what to do with this. Even better. If we're going to take down Hydra, we'll need all the friends we can get. Oh my god! I owe you one. You owe me more than that. You owe me a dance. This is nice. Do you mind if I have a go? Oh! Are you the 107th? I'm here for Sergeant Barnes. Who are you supposed to be? Queen of England? <laughs> Steve Queen Robinson. of your ass. The name's Captain Carter. Follow me, boys. I like how her hair is perfectly clothed. Air support. Send air support. Oh, Bobby looking good. Oh, What's up, Bucky? Steve? Rogers. Does he have an iron suit? I don't think so. Oh, Steve. Oh, wow. wow. Steve. Oh. Hey, Peggy, now you owe me one. Oh. oh. I didn't pay attention. Steve, get it. Hold on a second. She's friends with that, that Hydra Stomper? I think I'm friends with him, too. <laughs> Make me some new dancing shoes. What do you think? Well, then we better start dancing. This is so good. Oh, shit. Oh. Yo, uh, I'm in love with both of them. Uh, I need a whole series with. Captain Carter you can't even and drive Steve a car. in the Iron So suit. a dame and a flying Buick. Okay, let's hear it for Captain Carter! Save the cheers for the victory parade! We have a war to win! Hey! I just love this. Oh, I just love this. Oh, damn, Peggy! Fuck him up, girl. Fuck him up. Oh! That was smooth as fuck. That was smooth as hell. Damn! Yo, Peggy! Oh my oh! god, that's such a good team! So awesome! <laughs> now she got the face red skull, but what's gonna happen with that? Captain Carter and this so called Hydra Stomper are wreaking havoc. <laughs> the Fuhrer demands your Freaking presence heavy. in heaven! But a god does not answer to a man. You lost the tesseract, a though, god. bro. Like you, you lost the tesseract, and now you play with my trinkets. Soon, the true champion of Hydra shall be summoned from beyond the stars. Ooh. My champion. Ooh. Yours. How oh, dare! Well, I mean, I'm doing nothing because you <clears throat> did. Ooh. The Third Reich. The Third Reich will fall, and Hydra will rise from its ashes. Oh, I miss a good whiskey, but the serum doesn't allow me to feel the effects. Okay, okay, I gotta ask, how do you feel? Want to get the serum? Honest truth. Not as different as you might think. I'm no longer screaming to be heard, to be seen, to be in the room. To be respected. Oh my god, look at them. They are so cute. Must be nice. I'm still that skinny kid from Brooklyn. Now just in a big metal suit. You're more than the suit. The suit is nothing without the man inside. You're my hero, Steve. Oh. I, I mean, you're a Girl, hero. don't fight it, girl. You know you like Steve, girl. <laughs> You're my hero, too. Oh! Whoa! Arn stole a Jeep! Damn it, Stark! Come on, Steve, let's go! Oh, <laughs> there's Steve! Whoa, hey, what's going on? Oh, 
no, 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 you continue. Just pretend I'm not here. <laughs> Fucky Bart stole a jeep. Our intel is correct, and the Red Skull, the very head of Hydra, is on that train. We can end the war? Yeah, I've heard that one before. Something about this smells as fresh as three-day-old fish. Oh no! Thanks! You almost ripped my arm off! Oh, gosh. What's your status? Do you see the Red Skull? I've got a visual, but I'm going in for a closer look. Copy that. Hey, don't forget to knock. Shut up, Bucky! It's a trap! So it's oh. a trap! Now comes the hard part. You go high, I go low. We'll shake hands in the middle. Howard. Yep, coming. Here. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, y'all could have gave him some armor. I huh? know, right? Give him a good. How did he get the tesseract back? Did I miss him? Steve Rogers. I'm sure that C-15 is an Easter egg. Uh, we're gonna have to rely on new rock stars. <laughs> tell us what that is. Good, because we don't have all day. Now where's Peggy? She drew the high card. His tentacles appear to be growing. All right. Good observation. Now, now what's happening with that? If I can get to the controls, I might be able to transpose the ingress and do sign stuff. You mean transpose the polarity and reverse the suction? Hey, being the genius is my thing. <laughs> Show off. Come on, come on. Speak to me, baby. <laughs> and everything's in German. Great. Well, figure it out. Ah, oh! genius, you don't know German. Hey. Come on. Oh, shit. Wow. Who just has a sword just hanging out? Whoa. Whoa. 
Mr. Pot and Poo. Don't tell me the American playboy needs help pushing buttons. Eddie Lamar and I spent a weekend together, but she Eddie wasn't Lamar. teaching me German. Eddie Lamar. <laughs> years ago. You're going to be okay. Of course. We won the war. Her one choice gave birth to a whole new history and gave the multiverse a new hero. As for me, these are my stories. I observe all that transpires here, but I do not, cannot, will not interfere. For I am the Watcher. I really enjoyed this. I hope that, um, well, I mean, I, I'm not even going to say I hope. I know the rest of the episodes. I'm sure it's just going to get better and better with each episode. The possibilities! Oh my god. The possibilities. And I cannot wait. I, I'm really looking forward to the T'Challa episode. Me too. Um, just seeing the way that they handled this. There were so many things. I don't even know. Like, Steve and Peggy, number one, um, their relationship, the way that they wrote their relationship and the way it played out in this episode was, so, was just so well done and so touching and it made you remember why you fell in love with that couple in the, in yeah, the first they place. They were exactly themselves uh, regardless of the fact that their roles were reversed and it just makes you really, again, appreciate Peggy Carter as a character. Oh yeah. And, you know, I, I really be. wish we could get more of her because I think she is an amazing character. Yeah. Um, yeah, I just played so well. I just loved everything about it. I, I think it was for a first episode of a, of a new animated series. It just came out with a punch. The way they drew Peggy, it was so natural looking. It didn't look um, odd or unnatural. She just looked she like bad she, she looked sexy as hell she that way. And yeah, I, oh man. Um, yeah, I just can't wait for the rest of, of the series. And uh, once again, bravo, Marvel. <laughs> Shout out to Sebastian Stan and his uh, young Bucky uh, work in this. I really, really enjoyed Shout it. Shout out to Ross Marvel. And once again, sort yeah. of like the, the, the voice. Red Skull. 
is doing he he does a lot of different types of uh, voices and he has done um hugo weaving before uh he was that in endgame um and yeah i just so yeah shout out to him because he's he's kind of like just popping up everywhere and i, and I love that he's a part of the mcu in this capacity so yeah yeah, we, we really, really love this, and I cannot wait for the next episode and the rest of the season. If you guys like what you see, please like our video. Let us know in the comments below how you feel about this first episode of What If, and if you guys are excited for the rest of the season like we are, especially oh, T'Challa in space. <laughs> Star-Lord T'Challa. Cannot wait. Um, and uh, make sure you're subscribed if you haven't already, and that you have your notifications turned on so you don't miss a video from us. You know, we're approaching our 4,000 subscriber mark, like we said, so please do consider becoming one of those subscribers because there's going to be a lot of awesome stuff coming your way. And uh, until next time, we'll see you.